Almighty, ever-living God, be present by the mysteries of your great love and send forth the spirit of adoption to create the new peoples brought to birth for you in the fonts of baptism so that what is to be carried out by your humble service may be brought to fulfillment by your mighty power through Christ our Lord. Amen. O God, who by invisible power accomplish a wondrous effect through sacramental signs, and who in many ways have prepared water your creation to show forth the grace of baptism. O God, whose spirit, in the first moments of the world's creation, hovered over the waters, so that the very substance of water would even then take to itself the power to sanctify. O God, who by the outpouring of the flood foreshadowed regeneration so that from the mystery of one and the same element of water would come an end to vice and a beginning of virtue. O God, who, called, who caused the children of Abraham to pass dry shod through the Red Sea so that the chosen people set free from slavery to Pharaoh would prefigure the people of the baptized. O God, whose son baptized by John in the waters of the Jordan was anointed with the Holy Spirit as he hung upon the cross, gave forth water from his side along with blood, and after his resurrection commanded his disciples, go forth, teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Look now, we pray, upon the face of your church and graciously unseal for her the fountain of baptism. May this water, received by the Holy Spirit, the grace of your only begotten Son, so that human nature created in your image and washed clean through the sacrament of baptism from all the squalor of the life of old, may be found worthy to rise to the life of newborn children through water and the Holy Spirit. May the power of the Holy Spirit, O Lord, we pray, come down through your Son in the fullness of this font, so that all who have been buried with Christ by baptism into death may rise again to life with him, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Springs of water, bless the Lord. Springs of water, bless the Lord. Give him glory and praise forever. Give him glory and praise forever. Jasmine, we now ask you to reject sin and to profess your faith. So Jasmine, do you reject sin so as to live in the freedom of God's children? I do. do you reject the glamour of evil and refuse to be mastered by sin? I do. do you reject Satan, father of sin and prince of darkness? And Jasmine, we anoint you with the oil of salvation. In the name of Christ, our Savior, may he strengthen you with his power, who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. Jasmine, do you believe in God the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth? Do you believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was born of the Virgin Mary, who was crucified, died and was buried, rose from the dead, and is now seated at the right hand of the Father. I do. do you believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body and life everlasting? I do. I now invite the Jasmine's family and friends, if you wish, to come <laughs> gather closer to the font.
and Jasmine, I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. You who have put on Christ, in him you have been baptized. Alleluia, alleluia. You who have put on Christ, in him you have been baptized. Alleluia, alleluia. Tell us, tell us. Jasmine, you have become a new creation. You have clothed yourself in Christ. See in this white garment the outward sign of your Christian dignity. With your family and friends to help you by word and example, bring that dignity unstained into the everlasting life of heaven. Carly, as Jasmine's godmother, please come forward to, to give Jasmine the light of Christ. Jasmine, you have been enlightened by Christ. Walk always now as a child of the light, and to keep the flame of faith alive always in your heart. When the Lord comes, may you go out to meet him with all the saints in the heavenly kingdom. 